What are the learnings, if there are two learnings that you think you try to take out into um, out from the forces in the way that you deliver what you see is important to deliver? Uh, and I would say the first thing is involvement of the people that are going to be doing whatever activity or initiative it is. There's a perception of the military that it's all about I bark orders and you do. Yeah. Um, but the way in which they operate, what some call freedom within a framework, mm -hmm. I think is, is a vital technique that the military use that I now see used an awful lot to great success with a range of different organisations. So not telling people what to do, not saying you will deliver this by this date on this time, to say this is what I'm trying to achieve, here are some delegated boundaries within which I'm happy for you to have freedom to operate yeah. and literally you've got freedom to operate yeah. and as long as you're inside those boundaries and you're moving towards what I want to achieve how you go about it is entirely up to you go away have a think about that for however long you can give them or want to give them then come back to me and tell me how you're going to deliver your part of my plan and getting that involvement through that delegated, empowered piece, if you like. The military call it mission command. Yeah. Um, I have called it heard by other organisations, freedom within a framework, where you're empowering people to use their initiative and use their innovation. That, I think, is one particular learning. And, and with most of the organisations I work with now, it's something that I encourage them to do.